Yo, what's up guys? It's me, your boy. And I uh, just got this uh, new After Hours Criterion uh, for their 50% uh, off sale. It's the 4K. Um, this just came out. Um, I did uh, pop this a little bit because I'm doing this one-handed. So um, we're still going to unbox and see how this looks together. I just gave myself a head start because it's really hard to open the uh, plastic when you got one hand and the other hand's recording. Um, so anyways, um, you know, there's the back cover. Um, this movie... There's the spine. Oh my god, it's beautiful. I love that, like, teal and pink look. It's so 80s. Um, but this movie, uh, actually previously was only available on DVD. Uh, so it's really, really cool to get that jump from Criterion, nonetheless. Um, jump right into HD. So let's rip this sucker open and see what it looks like under the figurative hood. Um, apologies if you hear Miss Rachel in the background. I do have a baby, so, you know... She's really annoying, but, like, no disrespect to her because she teaches my kids and she watches them while I do Blu-ray videos. <laughs> this is a, this is a really nice packaging. Look at that. All right, let's bust it open. I can't wait any longer. I've been waiting for years. Oh, man. Oh, it's a two-disker. Oh, God. Get ready. Oh, look at that. It's got the little burglar thing from the movie. If you know, you know. These discs. Oh, man. That's nice. That is very, very nice. Let's see what this looks like. Oh, it looks like a map. Probably of New York, because it's a Scorsese movie that takes place in New York. You wouldn't believe it. A Scorsese movie that takes place in, in New York? Get out of here. Impossible. Oh, God. Too hot for YouTube. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe I'll get demonetized. We'll see. I don't I don't make any money anyway, so good luck. Um, <laughs> does that count as, like, adult content? I don't know. I mean, it's just a... You know, that shit happens every day. You've never had that happen to you? <laughs> Shark in the water and it, uh, anyways. <laughs> oh, God, there it is again. Get out of here. You're going to get me in trouble, Blu-ray. Look at that. Comes with this little uh, leaflet, I guess. That's nice. Very nice. I think Criterion as a standard should just have all their stuff released on a digipack. Because uh, that's what everybody likes is the digipacks, right? Like, I don't know if I've met a single collector who doesn't like digipacks. Um, oh, wow, look at this on the other side. I, mean, I, I, just, I should shut up and just show this. Like, look at it. This is way more interesting than the shit I'm saying. Wow, we. Look at this. It's so 80s looking. Imagine that. A movie that's from the 80s and 80s looking packaging. You don't believe this shit. What's next? A Scorsese movie that takes place in New York? <laughs> but, uh, yeah, that's, that's the, uh, that's it. Yeah, that's After Hours. 4K Ultra HD. I'm going to pop this in. I can't wait to watch it. Uh, it'll only be my second time watching it. The first time I watched it, absolutely loved it. It's one of my all-time favorite Scorsese movies. I only just watched it like a few months ago. Um, but if you like uh, Scorsese movies already and also you like kind of like really tense comedies that are a little bit over the top, I think you'll like this a lot. It's really, really good. It's one of those movies where it's just like domino effect. Like everything that can go wrong is going wrong. I've heard this movie be called Kafka-esque, and I would say it's Kafka-esque if I knew what that meant. But I don't. But uh, if you know what that means, uh, this movie's that. Anyways, guys, have a good night. Uh, party on Wayne. Stay healthy. All that shit. I'm not staying healthy. I just had Taco Bell. Anyways, good night. I love you.